Hello, Martin. I've missed you a lot. Um, I'm being festive. I have my Santa cap on. And I can completely sympathize with your working all the time. I mean, if you didn't notice, I'm filming this from my job. Oh my god, welcome to my hell. But I think you got it all wrong, man. I would totally love a fetus cookie cutter. Like, you should send me one. Uh, wouldn't it be awesome like if you could take these cookies, fill them with jelly, and then, you know, have, just have them at a party and just start munching on your jelly-filled fetus cookies? It'd be amazing. That's it. When I'm not at work, I'm asleep, so I haven't been on the internet in ages, and I haven't actually watched any of my vi subscriber videos in ages, and yours was the very first, and I'm so happy to see your face again. Again? No. I'm so happy to see your face again. Um, I miss you. I love you. I'm kind of sick. And I have 94 videos in my watch queue. Oh, uh, yeah, look at that. Oh, God, I don't even know if you can see it. Yeah, 94 videos to watch. There's a lovely little screen cap of you. I just caught the best face ever, didn't I? Just... Perfect gifts for 2010. I've discovered some very interesting gifts. One of the top Christmas presents this year is the Addict Ball. Oh, my God. I swear, every year my mother buys one of these. Thankfully not for me. They do my absolute head in. Why am I letting this play? I don't know. Do you ever watch yourself? I watch yourself a lot. The thing about the ball, it's impossible to do it. You lose it, then you end up having to hold it. What is the point? Remember it or write it down somewhere. You don't need it to be. Oh yeah, bathroom scales. For 106 pounds, I'm sure you're all going to be rushing out to buy a set of bathroom scales. Now, if anybody gave me a Christmas present of a bathroom scale, let's just say the police might be joining me for Christmas because I'll probably pick it up and throw it at whoever bought it for me and make them lose a considerable amount of weight instead. I just item that seems to be on a lot of the top 10 Christmas lists this year is the Xbox, Xbox Connect. Connect. Yeah, I don't agree. want one. I think if I actually had an Xbox Bars Granddad, jumping up down, flipping the rub, seeing Granny trying to attempt to dance off with her six-year-old grandchild the doors, or prisoners. My most interesting discoveries were from the Christmas gag list top 10. My favourite one being the Sarah Palin toilet paper, because we all want to wipe our asses on her face. Toilet paper should just have her face on its stand. Sarah Palin is a very nice lady. Well. She Today just shouldn't be in charge of anything. For me, it is a fetus cookie cutter. Fetus cookie cutter. Make cookies in the shapes of fetuses. Nom 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 nom. I see wanted to even have this gift is Tom Cruise. Why on earth would someone even think about this? Whoever designed Because fetuses are delicious. And then given a wireless weather clock. Come on kids, let's go and make some fetus shaped cookies. Yes, it is just one of these things that we'll never ever find out. So thank you very much for watching. Have an absolutely amazing Christmas. And I hope to get rid of this cold by the time the new year comes around. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you just after Christmas. Goodbye. And I'll see you just after Christmas. Love you, Martin. Deuces.